It has been seven months since a 20-year-old man living at Sun Peaks Resort vanished. His mother, Heather Stuka, said she hasn't given up hope and is still searching for her son. Obviously, I don't think we, uh, we ever thought we would be in this position in the first place. It wasn't something we ever thought about. And I certainly, given the, the day that we got the, the text, I could never imagine that we would still be doing this seven months. And even at seven months, I can't believe that, you know, we could be doing this for the rest of our lives. There's no guarantee that, that this will ever end for us. Sometimes if I think about it too much, is a little overwhelming. Stuka was last seen leaving a party near Burfield Drive at about 2 a.m. The party was just a short walk from his residence. Him and his family are from Beaumont, Alberta, and he had just moved to Sun Peaks Resort in December to work as a lift operator. He was expected to stay only until April. The family returns every month to search for Ryan. We feel connected when, when we're doing that. When we go up and we search, we feel connected to, to him and, and know that we're, we're doing something. I don't, I don't think that we could ever stop searching for him. I think then, then at that point I will feel like I failed as his mother. That isn't an option for us. We'll, we'll keep searching. Heather said she believes that her son is still at Sun Peaks. Unless you've been um, t to um, that whole Sun Peaks area from the bottom of Hefley all the way up, it's just vast. There's so many logging roads. There's so many um, terrain areas that, that, you know, he could be, he could be anywhere. I just need one person to find Ryan and, and it could be somebody that was, that's wandering the area, that's hiking, that's hunting, that's snowmobiling, that's whatever um, the case may be. I just need one person. The family will be searching at Sun Peaks again on October 12th and 13th and anyone who wants to be involved can reach out at ryanstuka.com. For Castanet News, I'm Alana Kelly in Kelowna.